So how are we doing guys and welcome is Kraken here back in seven days to die alpha 19.1 it is four o'clock in the morning and we're back in the dummies guide day number 16 now one of the biggest things about getting the motorbike in the last episode is the fact that we're going to be using next to no stamina anymore stamina is not going to be as much of an issue at all when you're running about the the zombie lands, the wastelands, wherever, um, or using the the bike, it's like you're sprinting the whole time. Now, what I am going to do, what I always like to do, is leave the bike here. Because there's been plenty of times where I've either died or something has happened, and I've ne then needed to get back to wherever that quest was and sometimes it's not overly close so leaving the bike here is always something good to do now i'm gonna go today and we're gonna do a little bit more a little bit more exploring we're gonna quickly run up and do this um tier two because it's right next to us then we're gonna come down see the trader and we've got this big road that follows down here. Um, where's the edge of the map? So the edge of the map is... Mm, it is actually a little... It is quite close. Yeah, because there's no main road that goes out that way. I know, we're probably going to follow. Probably come down to this road here. We know we've got Wayne Manor and Graces down here. But we're going to wait till our game stage is high before going through those. But we're going to just see, go and do a bit of exploring. Now it's easier to explore after that absolutely pain in the ass of a trip up there. We're just going to see what's around us down here. And then just go and have a look around. So let's get cracking. Right, here we are. We're here in seconds. This is going to speed us up so much time. Let's, we're going to use our new ratchet. And straight away we've got ourselves, well there's 100, 229 gas. That's not too bad at all. What do we get over here? I do like this new ratchet. I've never actually used the impact gun yet in the game. So there we go. 509 gas. So not too shabby at all. Right, we're going to put you straight in there. You, there's two ways of doing this. You can refuel like that, or you can actually go into open this and you can refuel like there, so that got us to 97. I don't believe any of these still... I don't think any of these actually work yet at all. Right, let's get you lot up and out of the way. Right, what have we got to do up here? That looks a little bit ominous to me. Oh, thank you. Uh, this is a Truth of Supplies. Now, oh, well, here we go. Workbench. Always check these out. Obviously, yesterday we were express raiding because we wanted that bike. There we go. We'll we scrap you. Take the parts. Right, there we go. Have we got any berries or any potato plants? We've got some blueberries. Not really fussed about those. Is there any potato plants or something like that in here? Maybe there's a zombie in there. We'll remember that. Right, let's get this started. It's activated. And we'll come straight back into here. Destroy workbench again. That time we got some duct tape. Oh, we got some steel this time. Okay, thank you very much. And we're going to run back over here. Hopefully the zombie's still in the same place. And uh, no, you're not. You've got to remember that things do move depending on your game stage and how things have started. Right. Ah, there we go. You can climb up this trellis work. Count for the vultures. If there is any. Oh, 
So we're entering on the reef. Oh, now I do know this. There's always landmines and stuff over here. Now they do have a zombie there. Uh, do I have any rocks on me? No. So you can't get too close to him because he's going to run on over. And do that. Sounds like we've woken a few others. I'm not surprised. Away from those landmines. Hello. Dodgy floorboards over here. Okay, see any more down here? Where are these guys going mad? Come on out, Loza. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. <laughs> get wrecked well obviously we've read that book now so we've got more chance of knocking zombies down using the power attack the corn mill leave you in there Whew. Actually, now we've got this level four with two mods in it. We're actually power attacking is killing these guys in one go. Bookcase. Oh, God. We're going to keep hold of it just for the second to see. Now we, we've got more room. Oh, look how easy that was. We've got more room now. Now we've got the motorcycle. We've got more room. So we can sell these books. You know, 200 jukes is 200 jukes. So if we can sell, sell things, we will. We get to the point where we're fully encumbered and our bike's full. We'll just read it and get the XP. Medical supplies. We do need to find that acid. That it is. Ooh, serrated blade mod. Or is that diamond tip? Temper blade mod. Okay. Oh, hello. <laughs> uh, you're down in one. Don't even use it. Oh, we've pissed you off. Oh, beautiful loot sack. Level three hunting rifle. Okay, don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. Well, we'll definitely be selling you on. Right, where's the final loot going to be in this place? All I'm really interested in now, obviously, we've completed the quest. But you know how much I like my loot. We need acid. And how much are you worth? 192? Okay. You'll notice as soon as you get the motorbike, you play this game in a totally, totally different way. Well, I certainly do anyway. Especially when it comes to things like brass, lead. We've got the room now. Carry those. Level 6, are you worth anything? 90, not really loads. Scrap you if I... There's going to be something in there. Sink. No acid though. No acid. We need the acid. Like the people in the 90s needed it. We need the acid. Blue. Ooh, urban combat. 
Learning how to jump and land quietly is an urban combat. Learn it and stay alive. When sneaking, you always land silently unless you're taking damage. Oh, that's all right. Okay. Let's check the car. And we got back one of our engines straight away. Perfect. This is where the guy was. Blueberry plant. Oh, this just takes us through to here. You're not in there this time. So that shows if we had gone through this POI as just us at our level, our game stage, it would have actually been slightly harder for us. Oh, cowboy. Oh. <laughs> Is that your arm or his leg? Right. Beauty. So it would have been harder for us. No, we don't want cooking pot. We want acid. Oh, red tea. Oh, we'll scrap them. We'll scrap you. Right. Here we are. This is the um, final loot. Nice and easy. Get ourselves into the day. And it's only half eight. Even just riding over here was faster than normal right beautiful let's get this opened up get our looting goggles on here we go working stiff starting to get better things right block damage 64 block damage at 65 but that's got two mods in it so the level four is actually going to be slightly better now but we still got the stamina, so way up the pros and cons of that one at a later date. Scrap you, we'll, we'll take those parts though. Bit of ammo. Yeah, never say no to that. As you notice with the gun, I always run with about half the amount of ammo. Because when we find ammo, you don't want it taking up another slot. Now, I did repair my gun overnight so it was very close to dying. No, no, we are going to be throwing some stuff out. Uh, there we go. What do we got in here? Oh, you're kidding me. Wow. The auto shotgun schematic, a gun I've never actually had yet in the game. Well, let's read that straight away. Oh, that makes me that makes me excited. Very excited. Right, let's just throw a few, bit of this out. We've got to read that one because we haven't read it yet anyway. Um, uh, scrap you, throw the paper out, and we'll drink you. There we go. Oh, that makes me extremely excited. Things have just got better. What do you need to make it, though? <clears throat> 30 steel, 6 shotgun parts, some springs. Not that much at all. Now, we haven't specced into um, shotguns as of yet, but we we're going to when we got a better shotgun. So I'm not going to make it straight away because at the moment it's going to be uh, tier one. It's going to be rubbish. So we're going to wait probably until at least level three, and then we'll make ourselves the auto shotgun. Right, here we go, back at the trader. Now, there's a few parts here I want to sell. That, that, we're going to sell the books. We're going to sell the hunting rifle. I'm, I've got no use for the hunting rifle. It's not something I am ever going to use. Same with the pipe bombs. They have fixed some of the issues with the pipe bombs. Uh, what are they? Stumbaton parts. Yep, get rid of those. They have fixed the issues with the pipe bombs that so they explode in your hands. But, um, yeah. If you are here to buy, I've got the best selection of medicine in the wasteland. Thank now you, that Jim. you have some money to spend, we're running a 10% off sale for the rest of the day. Hmm. Well, obviously, we've just found a better shovel than that. I'm going to take the bandages because I would rather be carrying the first aid bandages than those. Oh, we've completed tier two. Now, the machete is even better than this thing down here. The machete does a block damage of 23. This one is doing a block damage of... Well, we're going to take the machete and we're not going to be selling it. 
got any special jobs? I need someone who's willing try to... Try to hew. Okay. Be careful. Perfect. And try not to get yourself killed. Right. We're going to be selling you that because we just got ourselves a machete. We'll sell you these. Sell you that. And sell you that. And sell you that. There we go. 3,800. Beautiful. Bandages can go up there. Those ones can go down there. Jobs are good. And right. You have restocked today. So let's just have a quick little ganders. Well, there we go. There's the acid. Acid sorted. There's only 500. So we can make ourselves a chemistry station. But we still do not have that schematic. I re... Oh. That is very tempting. That means we don't need to put any more points into intellect. That is tempting. I might do that. I should have put my XP goggles back on as well. Okay, cement mixer. We'll, we'll think about that. We've got a couple of days. So we stopped till 19. But they're very tempting as well. Oh. The August schematic. Okay. Thanks for the business. We're open from dawn to dusk. Since, you got any jobs you know, close? Clocks. We always need someone to handle the tough job. Thanks, son. Right, let's go and have a quick look. Skull crushers, we're going to buy. Eye candy, we're going to buy. We're going to start using that eye candy a lot more now. 5,000. We've got a couple of days. We've got a couple of days. We don't need to buy the... Buy it straight away. Right. Opening new trader routes. That is where we're going. So, we have a new town. And I took the worst way to get here, off-roading. I imagine this road down here will eventually meet up with it. So we need to get towards the trader. We are going to quickly just run around this. It's nice now, again, with the, with the bike, that we can just quickly do this, have a quick scout out, and have a quick look and just see how big the town is, what we've got in it. And I can do that with you guys. So you guys get to see the POIs and everything at the same time. Um, there's the trader just down there. Oh, we've got the funeral parlour. It's a nice little place. Right, let's go and see... Trader Hugh. Okay. I never would have guessed you'd pull through, but you did. Some XP, so right? You do you have a job for me? Yeah, you got a tier three, only two hundred meters away. Okay. Beauty, right? What is our game stage sitting at, at the moment? Forty-five. So we need to go a little bit higher. Let's turn my light on so we can see what we're doing. We can get into his safe over here. If we can just about reach that, it is locked. We're not going to do it now because when we get a little bit high, we might get something really good in there to sell back to him. I'm going to quickly check his cabinet so while we're here. There as well. There we go. What do we get here? Blueberry buy recipe. Perfect. Corn on the cob. Uh, it's not worth bugger all, but we'll sell it back to him anyway. Here you go. To your inventory. We need to see that anyway. What have you got? Um, we got a pump action shotgun. Well, that's nice. AK-47. You got some good stuff down here. Cobblestone. Your acid. Is that cheaper than Jen's? Or is Jen's 500? Can't remember what I paid for it now. Right. Um, what helmet? That's nice. Well, you've got five mushrooms. I'm going to buy those. Can we turn those into mushroom seeds? But we have already got quite a few seeds. Uh, dart trap, advanced bellows, 800. Okay. Secret stash. What have you got? you got a mini bike for sale. Sham chowder recipe. Now, that is definitely worth buying. That means we don't set off landmines. God, you're done browsing. But we've got Next a bit time of time. I'll charge you for that. Right, let's quickly check out... Oh, that's actually working, so we've got a working forge down here. Down here in the west. Uh, let's go down into here. 
check out the chemistry station. Where is it? Chemistry station. Okay, destroyed. Got a secret stash, I believe, over here. Okay, not much. Oh, hello. Can we get up here? Another secret stash. And paintbrush. That one's locked, and that's got the gun safe in it. Fortunately, we can't harvest these mushrooms. They just tease you with that. We go up this one. We're into the middle here. We've got an ammunition box. Let's check that. Oh, that's... We didn't even have our lucky loot of goals on. Shh. Don't tell everyone. Right, triple storage mod. Triple. Double. 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 Nothing. Okay, well. Taking the double off and putting you onto there. So that's giving us one... One more. Right, where was that gun safe? I think it's the one in there. Where's the workbench? Oh, it's over here. Destroy workbench. Cement mixer hidden behind? There's his cement mixer. And that's destroyed as well. Okay, we'll take the cobblestone oil shell. Guess there was a little bit more luck, if at all possible. Neil and Fred. We got ourselves a book. There we go. We got ourselves a die. What's the book? Sniper. Do 10% more damage when using a scope. Right, let's put those back on. Cool, let's go and do this quest. Right, here we go. What have we got this time? Is a clear and retrieve. So we've got to do a bit more work. Let's just have a quick check in ye old garage. Because, yep, I can see a zombie up there, and I can also see two boxes up there. Right, well, you're all alone up here. Right, well, let's get rid of the car. Let's pay for all my fuel down here, and obviously we can reset this in a second. Ooh, a four times scope, an NAK. Okay, some machete parts. Working stiff. Okay, nothing we need. Scrap those. We've got a chance of one more over here. Engines and pressure plates. Okay. And let's get the quest started. Right. Now the quests are going to be getting more and more complicated. And more and more dangerous. Oh, it's only a double one. Okay, we'll read that. It's a shame. If you learn how to make the triple ones. Hey, Lost. And you're doing well. Oh, we got our first... Sledge. First turret. Now, that is the most useless turret in the game. But, it is our first one.
50% more chance for a spear wipe. Well, that ain't ever going to happen, is it? What have we got here? Stun batons? Well, I'm not going to be using them because they're terrible. Oh, yes. We now do not need to use that point. That has sorted us right out. Things are all going our way today. Things are going our way, right. Now we just need to get out of here and survive. Don't need a paintbrush, we've already got one. Then what are you hiding? An empty purse. Bloody spiders. Ah, oh, we were looking, I think, well, no, we were looking for a better helmet, weren't we? I think we've already got one or two of those. Well, there's a helmet, but it ain't any better. Bit of old money. Haven't seen any of that for a while. Put these back on. Let's get the XP. Come on up, you come, because you're going to knock you straight back down. <laughs> well, there's another one over there just messing about. Uh huh. The bloody pincushion. Right, uh, oh, hello, you've made it over. Give me back my arrow. Um, oh, uh, well, there they are. That's what I was trying to say. Satchel was somewhere here. And we've just found it. Let's get some wood. Free wood. Don't care how rich you are, how good you're doing for wood. There's nothing wrong with turning down. Free wood. Or free food. I wouldn't say it was free though. We work quite damn hard for this stuff. Some honey, that's very nice. More bookshelves. I haven't got the room. Let's just read it. Barbarula. Read. Oh! But you were silent! Spear Hunter, don't really care what it is. Ah, right, here we go. Well, this is the... This is the good room. And a skill point. Right, shut that door. Now, we haven't cleared everywhere yet, so we're still going to have to keep on following this around. But oh, we're throwing stuff all over the floor. Spring, mechanical parts, oil. And that'll do us. i scrap you for the room. Throw you out. Drink. Make more iron pipes, it's not an issue. Springs. Right, there we go. Check the cardboard boxes. Empty. Shotgun shells. Right, let's get back up into the ceiling. This episode's going long. Oh, I actually made it straight up through the middle this time. Right. I put my goggles on, didn't I? Yep. Yeah. We need to go down here. Come out, come out, wherever you are. We need to kill you. I was about to say, that'd be a very good place for a zombie. Weapons bag. Nothing we need. Neil and Fred. Beautiful. Right, well the final zombie is upstairs. What were you guys guarding? Oh my god, look how much loot is in this house.
Oh shit, it's 10 o'clock. Blue. Scrap. No, no, you keep the gun out, you. No. Weapons bag. Thank you. Oh, uh, we're going to scrap. Uh, rifle parts. Right, we've got room to get rid of you. This is very foolish of us. 10 o'clock at night. This episode is going stupidly long. Two people are going to have to do some work to try and edit this one down. Right. That is done. Well, we can't return to the trader. Is he shut? He's a part timer. We'll refuel you. We're into safety now. We're not going to stay down here for the night because we've got a motorbike. We don't need to. So I'm going to head home. Hopefully, a slightly better way than I did last time. See if I can find a road to make my way home. And then tomorrow. We'll do it all again, so as always, big thumbs up on the video. If you've enjoyed it, put any comments down below, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Take it easy.